school of redfish right here. They saw it and they moved away from it. There they are, they're back. They are right underneath me. There we go, got him. Oh, I sight fished him. Oh, he was swimming off with it. Well, good morning. Welcome back to another video. It's been a little while. As you can see, I can see my breath here this morning. It is cold out, um, but it's gonna warm up. It's about 32 degrees right now, but it's gonna get into the 50s today. It is a bright bluebird sky. Uh, sun is out. It is a beautiful morning despite it being cold. But um, today we're down in Charleston and uh, it's low tide right now. And so we're gonna work some deeper holes here this morning and work the entire incoming tide and then maybe an hour or two of the outgoing tide to kind of float me back towards the launch. So today we're gonna be targeting uh, trout and redfish and you never know, we may pick up a little flounder. Uh, that would be fantastic. So guys, I'm excited to be out today. It has been cold, it's after the holidays and uh, we had a major cold front come through down here in South Carolina, just like the entire Southeast. And uh, so I'm hoping that uh, I get on a little bit of a bite. You never know, it may be a slow day or fish may be turned on ready to feed. But guys, here we go. Okay, y'all, let's get started here this morning. Um, I am gonna try a new custom bait this is from a local guy down in Beaufort, South Carolina, Lemon, Lemon Island Fishing. I just want to make sure I get that right. Lemon Island Fishing. And uh, his name is Randy. Randy, shout out to you. Um, this is the three inch little swim bait that they make. And I've got it on a 3 16 ounce um, swim jig. And uh, the color is Nuclear Mud Minnow. So, Guys, we're going to give this a try this morning. We're going to get this down on the bottom. The action looks really good. And uh, we're going to have to work really slow today into some deeper holes. So I'm assuming there's going to be some deeper structure right in through here. And I'm just going to kind of pop right off the bottom. Okay guys, so I, this is from Lemon Island Fishing, again, that custom made. I don't know what the name of the color is, because uh, he sent some little samples to me. And um, so I'm going to throw this one. This is on a 3 16 ounce uh, trout eye. And I wanted something with a darker color to match the mud bottom. Um, maybe almost like a mud minnow, uh, you know, something along those lines. Um, so. I'm going to get that down on the bottom because that's where those fish were at when I sight fished them. I mean, they were hugging the bottom. So I'm going to put some Procure on this and I'm going to get to fishing. <gasps> Look, I am right next to a school of fish. Oh my gosh. I mean, right next to them. I can't. I can't move because they are stacked right here. Oh my gosh, there had to be 20. There are 20 fish right here. Okay, they didn't, they didn't spook. Oh my gosh. That, that is insane. My gosh. There we go. I got him. I got him, yes. Nice fish here. I picked one off of that school. Yes. 
Good, you guys. Picked one right off of that school. He's not ready to come in yet. Insane. Look at him. Nope, not quite ready yet. These fish are schooled up. He still wants to get out of here. Are you done? Yes. Guys, that is a quality red right there. Woohoo! Guys, that is a quality fish. Look at him. All right. Let's throw him on the board real fast. He is cold, too. He is 22 and a half, guys. Beautiful fish. Look at those colors in the sun. All right, I'm going to get him back into the water now. Just let him hang out for a minute. There he goes. He kicked off and he is out of here. They're just not real aggressive going after him. I just need to make sure that they're getting it. There we go. Fish on. Yeah, that red took him too. Yeah, there we go. Nice red. Nice red fish. He is about the same too. Nice fish. You ready to come in? There we go. Whoo, guys, yeah. Yes, another nice red. Another nice red. Yeah, look at him. Awesome. <laughs> he wanted it. Nice red. All right. Nice red. All right. Let's get him unpinned and back in the water. He's pretty tensed up and cold. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get him. Ooh! <laughs> he like bounced off of the kayak he was taking off. He was ready to go. Two nice reds. I'm pulling them right off of the grass lines here. There's a small school right here. They didn't really, they're not really spooking. 
I can see why they're here. I see a little bit of small bait fish. They're right out in front of me. They're heading right towards my lure. I may have just spooked them. They're still here. If I can get them to calm down a little bit, I may hook into one. I may have to move on. They may be on high alert right here. So this will be kind of my last little cast here. There we go, got him. Got him, yeah. Guys, nice fish here. Yeah. Yeah, man. I knew if I let him settle down a little bit. Woo! Fish on, fish on. He's a nice one too, guys. He is not ready to come in yet. Got him. Yeah. Woo. Look at him, boys. Look, he wanted that too. Nice fish. All right, let's get this out of here. Right in the side of the mouth. Look at that, it already came out. I'm gonna throw him on the board, guys. Here's my third red of the day. Nose on the board, pinch tail, 21 and a half. Nice. Good looking fish. All right, I'm gonna get him released. There he goes, right up into the grass. 21. Guys, the fish are chewing. All right, guys, let's go ahead and we're gonna call this a day and what a good day it was. Three slot redfish. Um, I missed one, the first one where I saw the school and he picked it up, pulled on it and then dropped it. So the key to today with it being cold uh, was a very slow presentation that was on the bottom. That's what I saw. So I was using that quarter ounce with the Lemon Island lure on it and taking it off the bottom. And then uh, I think it was the last one that I hooked up on. I had the Slam Shady, the eighth ounce, but that was up into the grass with some shallow water. So but I was still throwing him and letting him sink to the bottom with a very slow presentation with some small little hops off the bottom. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, subscribe. I know you guys watch the videos, but there are still some of you that haven't subscribed yet. So I would really appreciate it. It helps out the channel a lot. Um, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment if you got any questions. So guys, I'll see you out on the water. 
have a great day.